Hey, Luane. How you doing? Good, thanks. How are you? I'm doing good. good. Glad to hear it. So can you talk a little bit about your, your playing style, things you think you do well as a wide receiver? I guess traits are going to help you early on in your career. Uh, I feel like my playing style is like a little in between. Like, I, you know, I can go deep. I can do the long routes if you want me to, or I can catch a 10-yard route and eventually make it a long reception, things like that. Anything else for the way? Okay, let's go back to Brendan. Can you talk a little bit about the your fellow freshman wide receivers, what that group's like, how you've gotten to know those guys so far? Um, fellow freshman, uh, Camden, I got to uh, get to make a uh, good bond with uh, Camden. Uh, who else? BJ. BJ, yeah, BJ too. We've been bonding uh, real good since we first got here, so we've been going good. Go to Ira. During the recruiting process, I mean, obviously Florida State's had some guys come from Central up here. What is it about Florida State that, that kind of attracts guys from Miami to, to come up here? Um, I don't know any uh, anybody else's opinion, but you know, to me it was like kind of uh, similar here. You know, like the coaching style, like kind of tough, but it's like loving. You know, tough uh, like tough love coaching like TLC. So that's really what I say. Yeah. Gonna go back to the left side, Jordan. Luan, can you talk about your decision to early enroll and how your first month has been as a college student? Say that one more time. Can you talk about your decision to early enroll and how the transition has been to being a college student? Uh, to early enroll, you know, it just meant to me like to get in, you know, eventually get ahead of the playbook, you know, things like that. Uh, have a, uh, a better chance than enrolling in the summer or whatever. So just getting ahead, like, really. Go back to Ira. Did you, do you prefer receiver over defensive back? Or, or was it, like, were some schools looking at you at either side, or was it pretty much receiver? Um, I was getting uh, scholarships from both sides, but I prefer wide receiver. What is it? Just, you know, since a kid, since I was nine years old, I, I always liked catching touchdowns, so I just stuck with it. Aslan? Wayne, you were pretty quiet throughout the recruiting process. You made your commitment, and that kind of was it. Yes, sir. What was it, what is it about you that, I guess it was all business, and, and what did you need to be confident throughout the process? Was it just one phone call, one text a day from the coaching staff enough to keep you on board? Um, you know, growing up, you know, Florida State was my dream school. So, you know, I always had the love for Florida State. I always wanted to play at Florida State. So eventually when I got the offer, you know, it was like pros and cons to it. So that had to get weighed out first and stuff like that. So and then once it all made sense, you know, I just committed and I felt like this was where I was going to get the best development and the best coaching from. So I just never second guessed it. Corey? Coming in as a true freshman with so many other wide receivers in the room, there's only so many passes that can be thrown yes, in a game. What what are your goals as a true freshman wide receiver? Is it to crack the rotation? Is it just to learn as much as you can? Uh, definitely to crack the rotation. You know, get as much play time as I can, uh, and just you know, when it's uh, when it's an opportunity on the table, just take advantage of it. You know, that's it. Going back to Central, Central's put a ton of guys in college in the NFL. Yes, but how big of a deal is Dalvin, and, and is he one of the reasons that you were a Florida State fan growing up? Uh, yes, definitely. I used to always watch his highlights. You know, Dalvin's def he's a Miami native, so you know, definitely growing up, I was, always watched his highlights at Florida State, and it, it kind of motivated me. <laughs> There's only so many routes that you can run as a receiver. I mean, what are some of the, I guess, obvious or the bigger differences you're, you're kind of maybe seeing with a, with a playbook here as opposed to what you had to run when you were a Rocket? Uh, I'd say the difference is the routes are more depth, like deeper, deeper yardage. Uh, that's really about it. Concepts are kind of the same, you know, from high school. That's really it, just the yardage of the routes, that's it. Did you um, build much of a relationship with Luke during the process? I mean, he's he yes, could sir. be one of your quarterbacks, maybe your main quarterback yes, in your sir. career. 
Yes, me, uh, me and Luke, uh, throughout the recruiting process, we always use the text on uh, Instagram, just try to make a bond. So when we get here, we already have that like kind of strong bond because he's a quarterback, I'm a wide receiver. You definitely want to have a bond with a quarter with your quarterback. So definitely, we have a good bond now. Okay, anything else for the win? All right, we're set. Thank you. Yes, sir. Appreciate, Appreciate you. you.